Hello, how are you? In today's video, we are going to be testing out the Grambacher Artist Quality watercolors. I have been sent four wonderful tubes of Grambacher by a person who wishes to stay anonymous. Thank you so much for sending me these. I've never tried Grambacher and I've always wanted to try them because I know the name, but I don't really know how good they are. I am incredibly excited to be trying them. I have Aurelian Yellow, Kunakadon Rose, ultramarine blue and cobalt turquoise and because we only have four colors to test i thought it'd be good fun to try and do a color mixing chart with those four colors to see how well they mix with each other the four colors i got from grambacher are the aurelian yellow which is made from py151 which is a hue which is great because then it's not going to fade and if you want to know more about why you shouldn't use a genuine Aurelian that's py40 then i have a video for you which i will link on the top right hand corner then we have quinacodone rose which is made with pv19 and ultramarine blue which is made with pb29 and then cobalt turquoise which is made with pb36 that's all four colors swatched and color mixed i really like these colors obviously for it to be a proper primary we would need a cool blue rather than this warm blue however i really like these selections and the color mixes that i managed to get this corally color is absolutely gorgeous it's one of the best coral colors that i've ever been able to mix that's with the queen rose and the aurelian yellow also the queen rose and the ultramarine blue creates a gorgeous gorgeous purple and i love i just i re really like all the colors i managed to create this is a really nice muted sea glass blue kind of color and it's absolutely gorgeous the colors themselves on their own they are very intense highly pigmented very very easy to re-wet admittedly based on just four colors so it's not exactly a representative of an entire range but with these four colors i would say these are up there with the top brands like daniel smith Holbein, and schwinke they are highly pigmented really easy to re-wet and they gradate well one thing i did notice when i was creating a gradation is that the colors do travel quite a bit through the water if you think almost like core level of how it travels through water then you are in a good ballpark of how well these colors travel so if you want your colors to stay in one place this is probably not the brand for you but if you love seeing the colors travel through water and seeing the colors mix with each other and all that fun then this brand i can highly recommend the pale colors that i'm created from the mixes is also very very lovely Again, this coral waters down to a lovely pale coral color. These colors mix so well. If you just want to try a few tubes from Grambacher to begin with, I don't think you can go wrong with these four. If you want to stick to a strictly primary palette though, then I would recommend going for a cooler blue that is the more thalo blue yellow shade or green shade kind of color than the ultramarine blue. But with this combination you do get some really really nice color with the ultramarine blue too that i wouldn't want you to miss out like this color this color is just so beautiful so i hope that gives you a good first impression of this brand i will be doing more tests with all the brands that i'm going to be covering in the vlogmas in more detail later on in 2020 however for first impression i am very very impressed with grand Bocco. i liked painting with them. I will leave a high-res scan of this image over on my Patreon page that's patreon.com forward slash autocano so you can check this out in more detail and have a really good look at what these paints look like on paper. I will also leave links down below to where you can get these paints. Thank you so much for watching this video and a huge huge thank you for the person who sent this paint in who wishes to remain anonymous. There's a lot of you 
who wishes to remain anonymous and I am more than happy to oblige because you guys have been so generous in sending me all this free paint which I appreciate so much. Okay, I will see you in the next video. Bye!